All right, what's going on guys? Today we are playing some Bonanza. Um, I wanna kinda of do some trolling with the Cobra. So most people wanna go late in Bonanza and it's really funny when you're allowed to use the Cobra. Sometimes it's like, it's blocked out here and we'll let you use it. But today we can. So I'm gonna showcase a strategy on some Cobra trolling. Let's see what we get. Okay, this is only a 500 medall medallion arena and this guy looks somewhat decent. So, I mean, by his count anyway. Most players in this arena don't have very many. Um, could we go Cobra? Yeah, let's do it. So we want to go Heli, Farm, Cobra. And these are the powers I use anyway. Team Tower Stun, Lightning, and Genetically Enhanced Crops. So we're going to go for that. Oh, he does. Fourth Tower, doesn't matter, but could help. Okay, let's do it. And so we want to try and rush round eight that up go for a farm first let's see what he's going here uh, it's worth noting that most decent players can easily defend this it's just kind of like doing it for fun so if you're going for win loss you're probably if you're going up against a decent player you're probably going to lose the game because they can counter it pretty easily with ice super but a lot of players for whatever reason don't do that so it's always fun to imagine <laughs> them raging when they when they lose on round eight I think it's funny anyway. So the most efficient way I think to do this is to go for three plantations and then upgrade them all to the, the third one, the Republic. Okay, so he's applying some pressure here with reds. That's fine, we're just gonna use a lightning. We probably should too, honestly, but. Oh, he didn't send that many. That's okay. Oh, he does have ice, that's not good. Okay, hopefully we can rush him before he can get up at ice shards or something. Right, so let's do that. We're going to harass him with pinks, though, for sure. That'll cut his, his farms. He's probably going super ice, too. All right, a bunch of pinks. Cool. He's going to need, like, two or three ices to defend that minimum. Probably needs a third one. Oh, is he good? Nope, he's not good. We got to be careful, too. We don't want to leak too low. I like to conserve my lightnings, though. Oh, okay, yeah, here it goes with pinks. Okay, we want to send up more pinks again. Now we want to get up a heli. Basically, you just get up a heli whenever they start sending pinks. Let's go for a third. Yep, cool. And if we end up rushing round, you know, nine or... As long as it's not, like, later than round nine, we should be fine. It might not be round eight, but... Let's, he's going for a facility. Oh, damn, nice. Okay, we got ours, too. We'll probably use genetically enhanced crops next round. Okay, perfect. So now we want to use it, and we want to start offensive pushing. Oh, wait, no, we got to wait till round eight. Because if we do it now, we can't send regen rainbows. It'll just be rainbows. Oh, he's almost dead. Are you good? Can I just send him a rush of whites? That might kill him. Damn it, I need one more. Okay, please die to this. We can team tower stun him too. He's gonna be so pissed. Wait. I don't think, oh shit, I sent a bunch of space by accident. That's not good. All right, let's send a bunch of region rainbows and hopefully he dies. He's one, oh, he died. Okay, cool, that worked out because that was not looking good for me. All right, on to the next one, I guess. Yeah, obviously I could have played that a lot better, um, but good thing he choked. All right, so we're gonna see if we can get like three or four wins doing this, because it definitely can catch people by surprise, mainly against noobs. Like that guy was, I would say he was a noob, but he definitely isn't that experienced. I mean, I've got like three million medallions, 3,000 games. I can't see how many games he has because it's such a low arena, but he only had like 100,000 medallions, so. But yeah, normally this arena will go like uh, like super ice farm or like super ice glue. Normally you don't want to eco, but the extra stall sometimes is worth it. It kind of depends on how long the map is. You either want like the money advantage or you want the stall advantage. So this map's pretty short, which could work out for me. Just like the space station. Um, yeah, let's do it. 
there it is. There it is. Yeah, I don't normally use heli because it's, in my opinion, it's just not really a good tower. I mostly play boost only, and in boost only, I go like dark farm ace or tech farm whiz, something like that. So, uh, okay. And ace is good for ground zero too. We do go somewhat late and I can't kill him early on. All right, so he goes with the farm. That's good. Let's get a little plantation up here in a few seconds. Probably in 18 seconds we can get it. Yep. And I think we should actually send him a couple reds as well. We don't want to take away from our farms, but we do want to force a little bit of pressure on him so that he can't farm as well. So probably like five like that. Hopefully that forces a lightning or something. Oh, a glue, okay. I don't really get why people use glue. It's it's okay. It's just, I think lightning's better in my opinion. Because like pinks will still get past like with the glue. All right, let's use lightning ourselves. Can you hit some of the balloons above, please? No. Yeah, so he's playing pretty well so far, as you can see. He's, like, basically matching my farms. All right, instead of pinks, I'm going to send him a bunch of blues, I think. Actually, reds. Because there's eight per batch versus six. So he's not going to like that at all. Go for our first one. Plant our, what's it called? Republic, I mean. Okay, yeah, now we got to be careful. We don't leak too much. We do not want to die to AI. That'd be kind of embarrassing. What what is he doing? Dartling? No way. I... <laughs> well, okay, we didn't really get to showcase our strategy. I don't know what, what that was, but 131,000 medallions dies to AI. Oh my gosh, man. All right, let's get another one in. Hopefully we can actually showcase the Cobra, it working. Because the last two games, they kind of just died to AI. Well, the first one, he might have died to a white, and I just didn't see, but... He clearly knew what he was doing. That second guy, oh my god, I had no idea what he was doing. Yeah, but normally I play boost only. I'd say like 99% of my medallions are from Ceramic Crucible. Um, I don't really like playing the higher arenas that much. Like, uh, what's it called? BFB Coliseum and Moab Pit. Because there's like... I mean, I probably win about 50% of the time. But it's the games are a lot harder i guess and there's more risk involved like ceramic crucible i probably beat like at least 80 percent of players which but like, it feels good but it's also like you know i'm not trying as hard it's after work when i come home i don't want to have to like uh like go super try hard on these games i'm already exhausted for my job so that's also why i like playing these lower arenas too because i don't really care if i lose uh 500 medallions like it's nothing but hopefully we get our next guy here. There are 1,200 opponents playing in this, so you'd think it'd be quicker, but I guess the matchmaking is not as random as as I as it appears to be. I swear, sometimes in, like, Ceramic Crucible, I'll get players with, like, 2,000 to 10,000 medallions, and other times I'll get players with, like, 8 million. So it's, it seems random in the higher ones, but in the lower ones, it seems like there's algorithm of some kind, so you don't get just, like... Players with 500, <laughs> like that'd be kind of funny. Me with 3 million, I get like a player with 500 or 1,000 medallions. And I keep refreshing it, so um, it resets the timer. And, yeah, there it goes. Okay. All right, so this guy, 84,000, so not as many as I have, obviously, but hopefully he doesn't, you know, die to the AI. That'd be nice. All right, so we're going to go farm, cobra, and heli. Perfect. And I do want to use Team Tower Stunt. I, I did use this earlier. Like, I was just kind of messing around with that recording. And I knew this guy was so mad because I Team Tower Stunned him. Like, he used, like, a Spike Storm. And I Team Tower Stunned him. And it, like, barely killed him. <laughs> like, the rush. It's funny when it works out. But, again, I've always... I've also used it against opponents where it didn't work out. I went up against a player earlier who had, like, 1.5 million medallions. And it, he had, like, super ice, glue, ninja, just most broken four or three stall towers and super, so nothing I could do. All right, yeah, you never want to put your glue in the same spot because the balloon is hitting both of the glue. <laughs> it's using them both at the same time. So let's just send him a couple reds here to troll him a little bit. 
you want to spread them out probably like halfway across the map or place them down one at a time. All right, let's get our third farm up. And at a minute, we'll be able to get our plantation. Perfect. Yeah, he's farming pretty well too, so gotta give him that. Engineer, well, this should be a guaranteed win. Engineers cannot defend region rainbows. Like, if there's a little bit in round 13 on your typical boost-only rush, then maybe. But when I'm sending you, like, a ten, fifteen thousand dollars $15,000 rush, yeah, you're kind of screwed. So, all we got to do at this point is survive. Like, unless he has super ice, I I don't really see him standing much of a chance here. Like, even if he has juggle lance or some broken power. Using my lightnings because I don't want to leak anymore. Okay. We'll probably go for a heli, then go for a factory, and then uh, go for the factory round seven. If we can. Actually, maybe even round six. Perfect. Ooh. Micro, there we go. I think we'll use genetically enhanced crops round eight, though just so we get the most amount of money out of it. I'm not sure if it matters if you use it in between rounds or not, but I don't really, I don't really want to take any chances. Okay, and that's 16 seconds. Oh, no, nope, we can get it now. Perfect. Oh, let's use this. Gotta wake up. Offensive push him. I think we need five, so we can send him, because it's one per round. And then I think now we can, yeah, okay. So this is probably 100% going to kill him. I don't... He needs to do something. Oh, team tower's done. Yeah, this was like way overkill. <laughs> Face palm. Yeah, I'm sorry, dude. It's uh, is what it is. Even if I was going super ice, you still would have been screwed. Like engineer is just kind of a worthless tower in Bonanza. I don't know why you were using it. All right, let's try for one more. Hopefully this works out again. All right, 43% win rate. Uh, you do never know though. Sometimes people with low win rates are actually really good. Okay. So, Farmyard, do we want to play this? Nah, not really. It's too long of a map for Team Tower Stun to really work. Snowy Castle, this will definitely work. And this map's good, too, because it only has three farm spots. So if he's going, like, super ice, like something late, he's not going to have nearly as much money. And we only need three farm spots for a strategy to work. Oh, no, he skips it. Uh, Snowfall, that's okay. It's a shorter map. It's like, I would say it's a medium-sized map. But this map's good, though, for rushing, because, like, it doesn't really layer over as much as some of the other longer maps. Okay, so we're going to go for this. Where's the Cobra? Don't want to run out of time. Ice, perfect. Ice can work in case we do go semi-late and I have to send a BFBs or something. Yeah, that's the thing. If, like, your initial region rainbow rush kind of fails, like, you're not going to be doing very well later on. Like, you have to, like, send him a BFB or something, like, super early. Otherwise, you're just going to die. Or you're going to lose. I mean, you're going to run out of run out of money, and he's going to have uh, two good defenses. So, so we already went for a wizard, uh, which is not good. Like, you don't need defense up this early. You just kind of want to tank your lives. Even if you're um, not going with an aggressive strategy like I am, even if you're going passive, you, you don't need uh, defense up. It's a lightning for no reason at all. That's completely over defending. All right, let's get up our third farm here and get more bananas. And let's go for the plantation. So this is really nice. He's not sending me anything, no pinks or nothing. And we might, his wizard's towards the front of the map. So if we send him a few pinks, he might leak, I don't know. He, this guy doesn't seem to really know what he's doing, so he might panic and get a more defense. Yeah, see? They're kind of pushing. Oh, shoot, we gotta be careful here. Let's get a lightning. Let's not die. <laughs> that would be embarrassing. Okay. So he gets up another wizard for no reason. We'll take it. All right, let's get our third uh, Republic up. Beautiful. And then we'd probably go for a heli just so we... That's fine. We got one extra lightning. 
in case we need it. Oh, I accidentally went for Razor Router. That's whatever. In case it sends us yellow just on. I doubt it, but. All right, so we'll be able to go for a factory in a minute here. Perfect. Actually, I want to do this. Let's go for genetically enhanced crops now and buy the heli again. Okay, now we're gonna offense. Oh shit. We need to wait till round eight, because round seven, um, you can't send regions, like I said before. Okay, perfect. Okay, it's five, and you should be dead here. Unless you have tack, like, I think you're dead. You need a maelstrom or something. All right, I don't even think we need team towers done. Yeah, that was complete overkill. Yep, and that's a GG. Yeah, so the strategy is kind of fun to use. <laughs> I always imagine them like raging on the other side, like, cause yeah, like I said before, most people in Bonanza, they, they want to go late game. They don't like it when you, uh, when you rush. And I think Ninja Kiwi realized that. And that's why sometimes Bonanza, they like don't even let you use the Cobra. <clears throat> cause I guess, you know, people get their feelings hurt if uh, they get rushed. So yeah. All right, so I lied. We are going to do one more cause that guy, he clearly didn't really know what he was doing. All right, so we're gonna go same strat, this. I've also seen people do like a thing with the heli where they buy the right side and they resell it. In, in Bonanza only, that gives you a money boost, but I really don't think it's necessary, uh, at least from what I've seen. Like my strategy kind of works out without it. Maybe it would help if they survived the region rainbows and like you needed more money like right then, cause you do get a boost, uh, a money like net income, I guess. From, from selling and rebuying in Bonanza, but it's, my micro is not that good on mobile. It's okay, but, oh shoot, gotta get that. But yeah, on PC, it'd be much better. On PC, it's so much easier to buy and sell stuff, but on mobile, it's, it's definitely not as easy. Okay, so he seems to know what he's doing. He's going for farms, which is good. No defense, we're gonna send some reds at him. Yeah, the only bad thing about doing that is sometimes they retaliate and they send you stuff too. Whoops. That would be really bad if I actually used genetically enhanced crops there. I was going to use a lightning, but then I second guess myself. Okay, yeah, so he is sending me some blues. Just didn't notice before. That's fine. All right, if we do have to get up a hell a little bit early, it won't be the end of the world either. He's going wizard, so, you know, this should be a win, hopefully. All right, let's get our first Republic up. Wait, let's use a Lightning so we don't die. Perfect. We do have one more Lightning. This is why I like using Lightnings over like Juggle Inch and Glue too. Because um, Glue, for one thing, when he sends pinks, they'll still reach the end. And the Juggle Inch, it's, it's really bad for the early game rounds and you only get two of them. It's good against like region rainbows, but not in the uh, early game rounds as much. Oh shoot, we don't have a, that's really not good. We're gonna die. I thought I had one more lightning. Okay, good thing my micro is semi-decent. Let's do that. Okay, obviously not perfect. We did make a mistake, but nice. We should still be okay somehow. All right, hopefully, nice. And it looks like we will still be able to get to rush him round eight. So this will be nice. How many plantations do you need? I'm sorry, I wasn't even looking at his side. Like you, <laughs> you don't need that many plantations, man. You need to go for a factory. Okay, let's get ready here. Oh wait, I gotta use genetically enhanced crops too. I'll use that at the start of round eight. All right, let's go for that, for that, and one more. Yeah, this should be a GG. Should we say C? It should be a little toxic, yeah. <laughs> yeah, dude, there's no way. Oh, we, even if you ground zero, like, I'm, yeah. Okay, well, there you have it. I mean, this strategy, <laughs> strategy is pretty fun to use. Um, one of the guys did face palm me, so you know that they're upset. But yeah, let me know if you guys want to see more of this game. I'm having a great time with it. I mean, obviously, I've got, you know, almost 4,000 games. But yeah, it's pretty fun. It's definitely, definitely fun, especially trolling people in Bonanza. But all right, I'll see you all in the next one.